My break has been so amazing! Well, we still have a few more days, Kenzie. Yee. Hope smiles from the threshold of the year to come, whispering it will be happier. Alfred Tennyson In five days it will be the new year. I will make it better than this year has been, I swear it. My new year's resolution is to make life happier than how happy this year has been, which was pretty happy. I got to work on Castle and had a co-op job. Anyways, I want to know what everyone's New Year's resolution is. I hope to get tweets later on what they are. Forever here for you guys, Jonah. Well, I'm back again for yet another episode, but it's still the same poll. If you haven't, uh, you know, gone on and voted yet, we still want to know. Do you like snow? Do you not like snow? I want to know. The student of the week is Noah Hedrick. The staff of the week is Mr. McMullen, and the teacher of the week is Mrs. Jimenez. Class dues are $45 and they are due by February 28th. Also, yearbooks, you have to buy them before the 10th of January and they're $75, so get them now. Now, right now. Right now. Hi guys, hope you're having a great break. Remember, it's the same question from last week. What is the weirdest question you've ever been asked? In Germany, you can find many fake bus stops. They are there to prevent senior citizens from wandering off outside nursing homes. There is no hint this week, and there won't be any guesses. Nope. But the hint for next week is that Jeff is not signing out. He's signing you in. It's a sign, a symbolic meaning. That was too many hints. No, it wasn't. In class one day, Mr. Johnson pulled Johnny over to his desk after a test and said, Johnny, I have a feeling you've been cheating lately. So Johnny asked Mr. Johnson to prove it. Well, Mr. Johnson says, I was looking over your test and the first question was, who was the first president? So the little girl next to you put George Washington. Well, so did you. So, everyone knows he's the first president, Johnny says. Well, wait just a minute, Mr. Johnson says. The next question was, who freed the slaves? She answered Abraham Lincoln. So did you. So, I read the history book last night and I just happened to remember it, said Johnny. Wait, wait, Mr. Johnson says. The next question was, who was the president during the Louisiana Purchase? Mary answered, I don't know, and you answered me neither. <laughs> Happy New Year!
weather. Any resolutions this year? To embrace different types of weather. Even the freezing cold? Okay, maybe not all types. I don't think. So we'll see you next week on January 3rd. Remember to come back to school in a second.